So my beautiful people, I am back with another Elden Ring video. And well, we're at the 1.05 patch now and they have nerfed a few of the rune farms in the game. Fortunately for people that use the bird farm, it does still work. It seems a little harder to run off the map here, depending on the actual method and where you use it. But it still does run off the map, as you can see here. But hey, uh, I'll cover all the working rune farms later on today. But what I will say is they have nerfed a pretty popular rune farm where you throw yourself off the map, swing that sword, uh, swing that weapon, and you earn a ton of runes. Now I've actually found a workaround for it. So if you use this, you're fed up of farming the bird. Even though this is faster anyway, I found a fix for it. And today we're getting to all guys. How's it going, my beautiful people? My name is DPJ. And if you do enjoy the video, leave a like, it really helps out. And if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. So you guys know the popular grave uh, yard site where you throw yourself off the map. I've actually added some invisible walls to that spot. Now where we're at, we're in the Mogwin Dynasty area. Uh, everyone knows about this area, guys. Uh, the best farming area in the entire game. Now there's a few spots here. You can still climb up that mountain, by the way, and jump off that way. It's a bit of a pain in the arse. This was by far the easiest way to actually do this. Now you can run around. You can jump down that way. You can run around. I'll run around. Yeah, I actually tried and tested this as well as against the bird. This is actually faster than the bird because you earn about 150, 160k every couple of minutes. I mean, the bird's slightly behind, but if you plan on doing it for over an hour or so, you'll earn more runes doing this. And like I said, this farming spot over here was probably the best in the game in regards to throwing yourself off the map without having to do any parkour and climbing up shit. But like I said, they have tried to nerf it. Because what you'd do is you'd normally come here and jump across to that platform right in front of you there. But I've actually put an invisible wall there and I'll show you now. Probably going to die. As you can see, you just fall straight off the map and you die. You lose your runes. Hey guys, there's a fix, there's a workaround and I know exactly how to do it and I'll showcase it to you right now. Now, once you load back in, we're going to run back there. Uh, thanks to the super fast loading times now in the Xbox Series X. It's a couple of seconds, it's instant people. It is instant, so from that uh, same grace, follow the path I take. Uh, a, a couple of other people I've seen use other grace sites around this area to come here, which is completely fine. We all end up at the same spot anyway. But yep, let's run around here, keep coming, keep coming, keep coming, people. And the way in which you can still farm this is actually real easy, real simple. Again, no real parkour needed, you just have to jump down. So, let me get my runes. We come to this edge here, guys, and you'll see a little platform right down there. You see it? Literally there. Simply jump down into the corner, and there you go. Simple as that, then, guys. Just face the wall, double jump, go through it, and swing away. It really is that jump, uh, easy. That wall is invisible. You'll jump straight through it, guys. Remember, it's got to be a double jump. You have to be on your horse. You, well, I don't think you need a weapon in hand. You can swing your fist. Because uh, what's actually happening here, guys, when you swing your weapon, you cancel out the death animation, meaning you're just falling for a couple of minutes. And what will happen is the floor above you will despawn, meaning all the enemies will fall to their death. You get in their runes. Now, I believe you get about 150, 160,000 here doing this. This isn't, by the way, a new game plus. This is on the first, my first playthrough. I'm still trying to figure out a reason to go into new game plus. I'm not going to lie to you. But yeah, this, so this will be doubled in New Game Plus. Uh, New Game Plus 2, 3, 4, magic to be tripled, quadrupled, all that good stuff. So yes, keep that in mind. But it's super quick, it's super efficient, super, super easy. Uh, I think you do have to fall for about, like a, about a minute or so. It takes you about a good 30 to 45 seconds to get here, depending on the route you take. So you can earn, as you can see, right there. A massive chunk of runes and there's probably a couple more ticks if you do keep falling i don't think you'll get another another bunch of runes that much uh, we'll just fall for another about 20 seconds see if we'll get anything i'm pretty sure you do i can't remember i haven't used this spot in a while there you go there's another tick of runes so yeah there's probably a couple more too but hey once you've got your runes guys simply fast travel back to the grace you use to get here and then just run and rinse and repeat the process. It really is that simple. So yes, they can try and nerf these ruin farms out the game, guys. But hey, we'll always find a workaround. And there we have it. People, if you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. If you like what you see and want to see more out of the ring, be sure to subscribe. And hopefully, my beautiful people, I will see you on that next one.